another week of pure chaos. Rex Tillerson was fired on Twitter and fishermen in Nigeria were murdered. Tillerson was the long-acting CEO of ExxonMobil before trying his greased-up handed politics and has spent most of his career advocating for the oil industry. Now the fishermen were allegedly murdered because they were helping Nigeria's military search for schoolgirls who were kidnapped last month by Boko Haram. Boko Haram is a terrorist organization which has taken up shop in Nigeria, Niger, Chad, and Cameroon, has caused the displacement of over two million people, and yes, is still kidnapping young African girls from their schools as we speak. Now, what do these two tales have in common? Chaos, yes, created by opportunistic oil interests. Get this, some analysts suspect that Tillerson only went on The Apprentice, I mean, join the White House, to effect favorable policies for the oil industry. And similarly, that Boko Haram's real objective is not to create an Islamic state, but rather use that ideology to inspire militants to help capture control of Nigeria's profitable oil reserves. The moral of the story? As long as oil is a valuable commodity, oil-producing countries will oil ways be plagued with conflict because oil interests benefit from political instability. Bonus points if you Google why and tell me in your comments below. Now, if only there was a solution. Oh, there's me lucky charms.